today will be reading. So which one was I read? Which piece were we? We didn't read this one, right? Yeah, we still can. Okay. Say what? Girl beat and Curly hit the car. That's weird. Anyway, um, I think we read it. I don't know. Forty-five minutes later. Okay, kids. I've checked everyone's rooms, and most of you have done a good job. I mean, a pretty good job. You're all excused until super time. Except for Curly and Girl Bit. Hooray! Let's go, boys. I thought you, you said your rooms were clean. We said mostly clean. How are these mostly clean? Well, the ceilings are clean. All the walls are the, are the clean. Only the floor is messy. So the terms of surface areas, the floors are just a small part of the... I want those rooms clean right up now. But Dad, we get distracted. Dad, we try to clean our room, but we all, almost make, end up making our, our making, end up drawing or making comics. Alas, our hearts long to clean, but our stools must head the call of creativity. Oh, really? Well, that's too bad. I'm tired of you of your excuses, so I'll give you two choices. You could either clean your rooms with a good attitude or with a bad attitude. It's up to, it's up to you. Really? Okay, I choose bad attitude. Roar, stomp, stomp. I am Frogzilla. Come here, you bunny crayons, my favorite. Ha 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 ha! How dare you defeat me? Help! Please! Somebody help me! In the box you go. Not the box! No! Where's my next victim? Oh no, wait, please! Aha! You thought you could hide. No, please! I beg you! You can't hide from so Frogzilla. No! Hey, girl. Girl beat. Girl beat. What? Frogzilla is a really good idea for a comic. Write it down, write it down. Sweet. Let's get started. Okay. One time, a frog swam in a new school snake. Suddenly, he began to grow and grow and grow. Hey, Daddy, are those guys done yet? We'll make the, the comic club is the comic club is having a big meeting. We're making a new comic, Molly. It's called Frogzilla, and I bet you'll never guess what. Oh my God! I'm so sorry, dude. Loud. Oh my God. I bet you'll never guess what it's about. Um, is it about a giant radiative frog who destroys the city? Hey, how'd you guess? It sounds just like Godzilla. You can't steal somebody else's idea. We did it. Yeah, you did. Stealing is against the law, you know, guys. You guys. Molly's right. You can't take someone's idea. Oh man. But you can't make a poetry. What's a poetry? Oh, no, I think I read it. Oh, no, I think I read it. I'll still read it anyways. A portrait is a human version of somebody else's idea. Oh, so you're saying we can't copy Godzilla, but we can make fun of Godzilla? Yep, that's totally legal. Let's make a portrait. Okay, so like, um, I think we were in chapter five. Yeah, we were definitely in chapter five. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my God, should I delete this? I don't know. I should totally delete this. Um... I really don't know. Please watch to the end. I know it's like four minutes away. And I don't know. Do you watch guys like they're 30 minutes? Right? They're 30 minutes and like you don't make fun of them. So like. <laughs> Anyways. The poetry that relies heavily on the fair user's defense of to Flory Trail and, and library for the copyrights instrument. That's a lot of words. <laughs> Well, folks, the sun has set, and today drama slipped away, away, peacefully away. You kids get you in those beds right now. Morning. And now it's Saturday, a day of hope and grateful begins. New begins. You kids get out of those beds right now. Get in. Get out. I would not want. 
the, the common club doesn't meet on weekends, yet all those kids create to continue to creativity after a hardly breakfast, chores, independent meeting. Girly and girl are busying, are busy po putting the the finishing touches on the latest collaboration. Okay, I don't know how to collaboration. I don't know. We're almost done. Girly is just drawing the last two pages. While we need, we wait, I need to ask, what's the sign all about? Oh, that reminds us. Remind you to fail? No, to remind us of not not to be scared of failing. You see, we make tons of mistakes. And this reminds us that mistakes are just a part of the game. Yeah, we miss, yeah, mistakes can be fixed. Oh, you miss, you miss spelled miserably. Yeah, we know. Okay, the color is finished. Okay, the color is finished. Now we put the pages in door order, staple them, and it's ready for two galore. Frogs on. Frogs on. The time wasters. A portrait by Girly and Curly. One day, one time at school, Frigley and Jill and and Jazz and Jazz. I'm reading that right. Jazz, jazz, jazz. Okay, stop wasting time. We're not wasting time. This video game teaches valuable, valuable life skills. Quick, smash that evil, evil bunny. Give me that phone. Oh man, what a rip. You boys need to do your science project. Here, just to this crit this frog. No fair. Weak. Why do we always have to do this stuff? But then, hey, what? Well, we're frogs, so why are we just spinning a frog? Hey, I am. I object on normal grounds. I object on weirdness grounds. Okay, if you refuse to do your work, you can can stay after school and clean up the science lab. Boogers. I'm calling the cops. Boogers. Uh, I don't want to be boogers. <laughs> And so, man, I hate cleaning up the sign lab. Me too. What should we do with this dead frog? Just throw it away. I have no problem with that. What should we do with this frog trunk? Toss it. What about this dangerous onomatic waste? Blah, blah. Blah, blah. Two points. Now let's get our back, back to our game. My turn. Suddenly, from the death of the trash can, DNA of the fo forgotten frog morphed with the toxic rubber goo to create life. Roar. My turn again. Get those evil baby ducks over there. Hurry, your health meter is running low. I know. Roar. Hey, do you mind? We're trying to play a game. Oh my god, you didn't say that. That was really okay. Crash. Ooh. Hey, Frogzilla, you just destroyed the school, and he made me lose all my lives. How rude. That was an important game. I know, we almost re reached to level 9. How can anybody be so selfish? Frogzilla must be stopped before he ruins somebody else's video game. Beep, beep, beep. No, beep, beep, boop. What are you doing? I'm calling the cops for real this time. Soon, ring, ring, sup. What? He did. We're on our way. Come on, dog band. Frogzilla messed up some kids' video game. We need those jets. No way. But he was almost on level, level nine. And so, okay, dog band, are you ready? Everyone's counting on us. So let's try our best and not make any mistakes. Um, um, do you think that's a mistake right there? Chump. Gulp. Oh no, Frogzilla just swallowed Ch Chef, Chef, and Dogman. Weak bummer. But looks like it's up to you, Felix and Jays. You must save the world from Frogzilla. Oh man, what a rip. Will F Felix and Jazz save the world? Can they rescue Dogman and Chef? 
Will they ever reach level nine? Find out in our next truly part of two. Frogzilla versus Mara. I don't know what that says. Whoa, that was awesome. Let me go. Whoa, that was awesome. I can't believe you made this in one day. Well, it was a lot of work. Yeah, when we started writing, our story wasn't very good. We rewrote it two times, and each time we got better and better. So if you failed miserably at first, yep, yep, but we never gave up. If you want to be a good writer, you have to have the courage to be a bad writer. Chapter 6, Business Partners. Oh my god, it's 10! Oh my god, I'm tired. So like, yeah, and then we're going to be... I don't know how much time for you. If you know that, you can tell me in the comments. Anyways, bye, subscribe, bye. Subscribe and like this video. Can you stand there? Okay, bye.